Welcome to another episode of This Old Hoopty. Today, the princess and I are gonna be working on the 2022 Palisade. We're gonna be making it a little cooler for mom. We're gonna swap out the OEM grill for an aftermarket one. That's gonna be the Momo Real one up here. We are also going to add side steps over here to make it easier for this little one to crawl into the car, truck, SUV, whatever it is. Maya, you ready to get started? Oh yeah. All right, let's get to work. Let's quickly go over the tools needed to get all this disassembled. You need a number two Phillips head. You're gonna need a number 10 socket with either a ratchet or a electric ratchet. This will greatly improve the efficiency of taking things apart. The plastic ends of these will help in popping the edges of this grill insert out. In addition to that, if you break any of the little plastic pops, they can be replaced by what's in this bag. Also, Also, this little tool makes removing the little plastic inserts very easy because you're going to have Okay, let's pop the hood and let's go over what we're going to do to get this thing removed. Using the tool discussed before, we're going to pop these plastic clips out. So we're not going to pull this back. We're just going to pop the clips out and let the top sit on. That way, when we remove the bottom, it's still hanging by the top part. The same is going to go for these clips on the side here. There's also a 10 millimeter bolt up here in the corner. And Underneath the front lip, there's going to be 10 millimeter bolts here across the entire front. Here, here, there. We're going to take all those 10 millimeter bolts out. Once the bolts are out across the bottom, then we're going to be able to shift the bottom outwards. So we're going to start on the sides. And the top, as discussed, pulling those plastic clips out. Let's get that done now. All right, put your hand here so you can slide it under there and push it forward. There you go. And put it right here with the other ones. Okay, this one. Good job. I'm getting good at this. Yeah, you are. You are good. Excellent. All right, now we're gonna get the ones on the side. So let's do this side over here. Let's step down over here. Chair. Go ahead and watch your step, come around this way. Okay, we got more. Okay, we got this one here, this one here, this one here, this one here. Okay, start with this one at the bottom, right here. So without touch, without scratching the car. You want me to do this one? I can't do something very. All right, these are a little more complex to get out, baby, so I'll take these out. Take this, and we're going to put this on the bolt right here, okay? And push the button. Okay. Go ahead. All the way down. Here we go. Okay. Yep. Now let's get the other side. All right now we'll put all these over here, okay? the head so I'll put it on here put it in here all right go ahead push it all the way down all right okay we'll put the tool down over there and let's uh get all the ones across the bottom all the way down okay start working on finding this tree. So let's start on this end over here. Right. We're, just, we're gonna grab it over here like this. And we're gonna start working this free. Going along here, we're just going to kind of tease this out a little bit, 
like this. Try and get behind here. There we go. That's the tough one right there. At least that's what everybody says. It's on the internet, it must be true, right? Let's get the other one, same thing. Okay, let's loosen up our bottom. This side is completely free now. This side is free. Bring it in. You're going to have to come up and over the hood latch like so. Keep loosening it up. So now we're going to reach down in here. Come over on this side. This centerpiece is held on by the number two Phillips head screws around the perimeter. So let's get this disconnected right here. All of these pieces here. Now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Don't worry about it if it pops back in because it'll just be the bottom one popping in and out. Okay. Okay, once you have your side pieces unscrewed and unclipped, you're gonna to need to remove your bumper guard or your bumper insert because there's going to be screws in the corner underneath that and then the last clips are right along here. And disconnecting these will allow your grill to fall out. Let's do that now. Okay, same thing with these clips here. Just bring them all the way up and out. And there we go. Okay, our grill is free. We need to separate our top from our grill so we can start getting the new one assembled. Okay. Let's go on here. If you're having problems getting the uh, other side out, it's because there's little plastic pins in the top. You can see them here, these white pins. So make sure those are separated and hold them open or stick something in there like another one of these tools. And now we've got our grill. So now this is the part we're going to swap out. Might move down a little bit, baby. We just move this out of the way and get the new one to start snapping into place. Here's our beautiful new grill, which is very well packaged. Ta ta! You can include your original Hyundai badge with this adapter. You can pop it up in here and put your badge on it, or you can just leave it nice and streamlined. That's what we're doing. Let's back down. And now let's do the reverse of what we just did. Right here. 
once I've got these clipped in, then you're going to start bolting things together with me, okay? Because okay. these are messy and... And extremely sliceable. Sliceable. You don't want to get slicey, do you? Nope. All right, so I'll do the slicey bits, and then you do the non-slicey bits. How's that? Sound good? I'd rather do the screws, which is not slicey. Okay, that's a good plan. That's what we're going to do. All right, so let's get these back into their little homes. This is going to slide into here. sneak peek at our new grill. Pretty cool if you ask me. Alright, now let's get our screws back into place and we can start locking this thing down. So we're going to work in reverse from the way we took it apart. You have your screws in the corners and the bottom and that will lock the two pieces together. All of our clips are in and solid except for the one right here which is broken which doesn't matter. See, as you guys can see, there's a clip next to it here. This, there's no play on the clip, and you've got a bolt here. So even if you broke one or even two, as long as it's next to a bolt, it doesn't make a difference. But we broke one, and it's fine. We're going to keep going along here. I definitely recommend doing this with hand tools if you're not good with an uh, impact gun because you will strip out your plastic. I'm just setting all these in place, and I will tighten them with a screwdriver. I'm going to seat these on this edge here so I can get this lined up then I'm going to do the same on that side and then I'll snap them all into place. So I've got two into place over here, now we'll do the same on this side, line these up over here. This one in. Now I'm going to line all the bottom ones up. We're going to slide this into here. Now I'm lining up these clips here along the bottom. Just kind of working our way around, lining up all the clips until everything snaps back into where it's supposed to be. Okay, we're all in. We're all in. Any of the screws that were removed before need to go back in at this point. These are your final screws to lock in the front to the new grill, bumper plate. So let's get all these in. Are you ready, baby? Help yeah. me get this in. Take this in here. That in there? Take this in right here. You got it? All right, we're going to slide this right in here. This big opening needs to go in this big piece right here. Can you move it forward a little bit? You got it? Slide your end in underneath. Yeah, like that. Slide it underneath there. Perfect. All right, baby. You ready? You're going to help me put it on there? Okay, it's super heavy. I can't do it without you. You got it? 
Let's do it. Okay. This part here is going to slide over the top, over that little piece there, and these two bottom pieces are going to slide underneath the bottom. You ready? All right. Try not to let the side where your hands are touch where the paint is above where the tire is, okay? That's your job. You can do it. All right. Let's do it. Snap it in right here. Snap. All right. High five. All right. Let's get this side. Come on. All right. Snap this in right here. Push. One, two, three. Push. All right. And over here. One, two, three. Push. All right. And right here. One right here. There's a snap right here. Ready? Excellent. Oh, wait a second. You know what? Hold on. We dropped the pop clip down there. We need to get that pop clip before we start. So let me... Uh, it's on this side. I know, hold on. But we can't lose that because we want to replace it exactly how we took it apart, right? Yeah. Every piece that came off here should go back on here, right? It's going to be sitting in the little tray at the very bottom. We just got to find it. Can I check on my end? No, it's going to be right here. It's going to be right down there somewhere. Okay. It's going to be right here underneath here. So what I want you to do is I want you to hold this just like this. Can you do that for me? And I'm going to go from the bottom. I'm going to pull it out. Okay? And we found the one that was stuck in the car. Yeah, we don't, we don't leave anything behind, right? Mm -hmm. That's we, correct. We don't want to lose it. That's Ooh. right. All right, come here, lovey. This way. Not break the car up. Okay, let's get these little pop clips in here like this. Let's make sure they're lined up. So make sure we got the hole lined up here. All right, pop it in. Okay. Pop it in. We're gonna switch this around, and now we're screwing stuff in. So we're gonna go this way. All right, ready? Hold it this way. Come across this way. You ready? Let me get it started. In the hole right there. Go Thought you guys might like to see this new grill out in the sun. With, of course, Maya showing you the old one. Maya! I love the hat, baby. It's so cute. So, this is our old horrible grill that I never liked since the day I bought it. That is the sweet, sweet new grill. Pretty cool, right Maya? All right. Okay, we got the grill done on mommy's truck and I think it's looking pretty cool. What do you think? I love it. Did we have a good time? Give me something. All right. Oh, let's do that again. I'm sorry. All right. So. As I said, grill's done. We didn't get to do the steps this weekend, but we will do them in another video. Steps are right over here, as you can see. So we don't have time today. We're losing daylight. We still have to have dinner. We're gonna wrap up this video here so you guys know what to do. Like it if you like, don't if you don't. Subscribe to keep up with my latest shenanigans, and we'll see you in the next one. Say bye-bye.